My name is Darren, otherwise known as Sparky, and sometimes I like to make homemade bread because it smells really nice. But apart from that, let's go and check our team. We are using exactly the same team as before. Little man himself, Zoda, is up top leading the line, and we're just going to go straight into the first game, ready to pow pow, kiss pow wow. And I'm looking forward to just bringing up the form again, to be honest. Now, I want to go over a, a little bit of a rule change later on in the video, but let's go straight into his team. He has got a nice looking goal team there, a few, few different players, let's put it that way, it's a very mixed ability group uh, in the sense of the actual ratings and the mental capabilities by the looks of it. A bit like a Chinese chess team but without any real relevance at all. Talking of chess, I like to play chess when I was about five but I wasn't very good at it. So we go into the very early stages of the game here and we are, he's got a fantastic name there, Schoolgasm, and we start things off with a really nice little flick there to set the play up and we are performing the Jackie Chan jumping kick move from Crouching Lemon Hidden Zest, which is apparently up for awards. He then starts an attack, but we manage to prevent any danger going on. We get another attack here, and it's a very harmless shot, probably about as harmless as a five-year-old an ice cream van, but we keep going because that is what we do. Our spirit is high, our phenomenal nipples are great and we get a bundle goal of bundles now I'm no beautiful person in real life but I like a good bundle um, it ain't pretty but you know what mustaches on women aren't pretty but you just got to deal with it and you take it for what it is and if you gotta take work with it you work with it so they then get another chance here I think again it's a very tame effort coming up and yeah my keep Vine Feather is his, he's got fantastic hair as well him and Zola are going to be performing the new L'Oreal advert and we score a fantastic goal but it is offside unfortunately Lasagna has to wait before we can tuck in for a spaghetti bolognese with extra parmesan cheese unfortunately but you know what we keep going again it's exactly the same again he's loving his volleys like if he was at the beach he would be doing volleyball that's how much he loves it we then do a 360 pike somersault no skip mlg pro and yeah i love animations like that it really makes me happy and like christmas i guess so we then get a, a humongous lag fest right here i don't know what's going on i'm in tears because lag is killing me slowly inside and we get the penalty so it actually worked in our favor the ref is just jogging over locks flowing in the air and uh, I love his great socks and yeah he gets the yellow cards maybe could have been a red if you like red cards I guess but it keeps the game competitive I guess and the guy was actually speaking throughout the whole game and uh, I was kind of saying hello um, he wouldn't talk back so again trying to make friends but as life suggests I can't make friends Anyway, enough about my social life and my need for friends. We get the penalty here, slow motion for the action, sort of replay, make things really dramatic. Are we going to get it in? Zoed it up for the second goal of the game, and it's a really bad save from the keeper. I don't know what he's doing, but it works for us. And Zoda is just windmilling away into the corner. I don't know, he loves his windmills. Just rumour has it, when he was 8 years old, he went to a pharmacist and he said I like to windmill and they give him medication, it never works. But we go straight into the next attack and it is a beautiful, beautiful, a Barca style of play. beautiful bit of play. And I was, again, somehow, I don't know how this works, but whenever things like that happen, it's a really nice bit of play. I looked down, I'm just in my underpants, I was fully clothed, no one was in my room, but somehow my clothes just come off when we're doing this passing. Um, I'll try and see if I can figure that out. Maybe it's a pot of ghosts. I don't know. I don't believe in ghosts, obviously. Um, 
But yeah, we go and get Zoda. It's probably he's on fire. Uh, not literally because that'd be weird and it's a bit unrealistic. But he's just like I say, one of my favourite quotes: "Dish dashing his way through," um, and he can't handle it at the moment. It's kind of we just turn the game upside down, like you do when you play croquet with your nan. Um, so we go through again, Lasagna's got it here, can he finish to make the chance? No, it's not 4-0 unfortunately, I'm sure I've only seen two goals this game, I can't remember, I could be blind, I am wearing glasses, but I don't think they work, so we then go and go, 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 a really, go, really nice, good shot, <laughs> basically I'm, uh, yeah, going to, uh, work again on my English, because I could be Swedish, so, yeah, it was a really nice goal, um, that little first time dink over to Liz Chris Clements apparently, it wasn't Lasagna, I was going to say I'll call him Chris Fairy Cakes, I think that's a better name for him, we'll just name our player after food um, that way we will all sustain our need for food and again another penalty um, why not I guess, because I love penalties, he loves penalties apparently as well and it's a booking for his keeper and the police department looks really happy at the back Zola is going for his hat trick I believe, if I'm not correct then Shoot me down, not be back up again. Let's jerk it out, as several songs say. So, action replay again, slow motion. Kenzo to get his hat trick, which means a goal pack. He stutters, he pauses, he finishes, and it is a goal. No chance, holy moly. So, yeah, we have just gone 5 0 up. Now, that is a water king if I've ever seen one. We have just absolutely put him on the floor, told him. He can't play with us, and he's upset, but we've won 5 nil, so it's a great result. We are keeping the form going. We have not lost a single game. We've conceded maybe one goal, and we're scoring a hat full of goals. Zola is just killing things out there on the pitch. Killing it. It is illegal what he is doing, but it's great. It's absolutely fantastic to play with, and I'm still enjoying it. There's more flicks, like I said, than a Asian person's hair. Oh my god, I'm stereotyping everything around me. Um, yeah, I'm so sorry. Okay, so this video is getting taken down for stereotypical to, 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 for my English. Because, yeah, so we go and we know some stats, very dominant performance. Um, and we are nearly promoted again. So we get the bronze pack for the win. I'm not gonna, I'm gonna talk over the bronze pack actually. Screw the bronze pack. We're actually gonna think about changing the rule here. I don't really want to open bronze packs personally because. When we open them, we get Brian from Bloody Mongolia, who's like an electrician part time, and we're not going to use him. Like, seriously, we're not going to use any of these players. And it was a great idea at the, at the start. I thought it was a fantastic idea. Open bronze packs, they said. It'll be fun, they said. It's not fun, to be honest, because I'm using just a couple of bronze players, like English ones, for chemistry reasons. So I'm thinking a win is a goal pack, a rage quit is a goal pack, and then a Zoda. Patrick is something special. I don't know. I'll work it out. I've got time on my side. Um, I'll sit in the shower there and just think about life and figure out the rules. But yeah, I, I'm thinking just scrapping the bronze pack, to be honest, and, uh, and probably silver and just go straight for gold and just see what we can do with that. And yeah, it, it could be more fun. I don't know. You tell me what you want to see because at the end of the day, I'm very, very good at cooking cakes. So my knowledge isn't very handy so yeah i hope you enjoyed this episode guys i'm sorry for all my inadequate potatoes peeling skills and uh i look forward to the next element team episode which will hopefully be face cam which should be really really good because you will see my face that's not good anyway thanks for watching guys it's been fantastic so farewell and feel the same good bye the latest a little bit longer. Bye.